the time to hesitate is through. Good afternoon and welcome to our busy day. We've come to South Abington Township Park. I actually spent a lot of time here when I was younger because I'll show you where it used to be, but behind me there's basketball courts that used to be a skate park. Well, just basketball courts now, but this used to be a skate park. I have not been up to this park in ages. And by ages, I mean like probably seven years, maybe more. I know Amy's been here before because there's a splash park up above the basketball courts and that's where she takes Ari on days like today when it's super hot. Ari is the tiny little human. This little uh, shed here, someone has placed a little Tupperware box with a note that says, attention, dogs wanted. All you do is you put a picture of your dog in that box and they'll paint a picture and leave it here for you for free. And all they ask is that you do something nice for a stranger. And those are some of the paintings that whomever does the paintings has already made. It's pretty cool. I used to spend a lot of time here because the skate shop that I used to ride for is about a mile up the road that way. So we'd go hang out at the skate shop, the skate shop would close, we'd come down here and skate the park. It wasn't a huge park, about half of the area where the basketball courts is now was the skate park. There were a couple boxes, some quarter pipes, uh, there was a mini ramp, I think there was a rail. I think there might have been a hip or a fly box. I don't remember, it was a long time ago. But I mean, back then when there was no skate parks anywhere around here, and this was one of two that kind of popped up, it was nice to have it. Well, this started already. Yeah. Cause Amy made me be late. No.
the finished product. And that's what the finished product looks like. And it took way less time than I thought it was gonna take. I really anticipated that taking us like three or four more hours. Well, Liz and Morgan did a lot of the legwork and pulled all the bricks up, so it really only took about two hours. Talos, Italos, Utalos. Italos. Italos. Jeff. Liz, put your head in there. Jeff, That's more of a scale. Sauce, I know. Oh, really? That's the biggest burrito of my life. I don't know if I got that, but there's a guy back there in the corner yelling about turtle soup. Turtle soup tonight. Back in business. It's actually Sunday afternoon right now. I did not wrap this up last night like I had planned. Came home, got cleaned up sat on the couch so I can relax for a couple of minutes and out cold. Next thing I remember, Amy was waking me up and said, hey, it's time to go upstairs to go to bed. So that's what happened. But I just got out of my shower from my run. That was a brutal run today. It was like 93% humidity when I left. I don't know what it is now. It's a crazy day, kind of like yesterday, but a little worse. Yesterday, while we were putting the bricks in, it started to rain two, maybe three times on us, which is why there's not that much footage. Amy was in charge of the camera because I was I was filthy and I was on my knees and it was, laying brick is not fun, but it is fun. I like doing stuff like that. So I actually enjoyed it, even though it's not really a fun experience, but I digress. Anyway, today is like a ridiculous day. It's like, it was supposed to pour, all day long, but Mother Nature cannot make up her mind. It's sunny, it's rainy, it's sunny, it's overcast, it's thundering, it's ridiculous. I probably got rained on, I never got soaked, but I got rained on a few times over the course of my run, then the sun would come out, it's kinda, it's starting to go back away again, the sun was just out blazing, but when I let Oliver back in, you could see coming from this direction, it was just like gray skies and miserable looking. So I think that's rolling back in. It's not a good day to be outdoors. I, mean, I need to rehydrate. I'm dying here. So I'll catch you tomorrow for your next episode. Good night.